I'm Colleen G Lee and coming up in today's tutorial I'm going to show you how to use an overlock foot on your sewing machine. This is what an overlock foot looks like. We're concentrating this area here and in the middle of the foot there is a little prong and that is what enables the, the overlock stitch in order for it to overlock a raw edge or provide you with a decorative stitch for a sewing project. Here I have an example of what the uh, overlock foot can do. If you have a setting on your sewing machine, an overlock setting, this is the type of stitching that you'll have. If you don't have a setting for an overlock, you can use your zigzag um, stitch with your uh, overlock foot and it will give you this kind of stitching. Once your foot is in place, you need to align the inner side of the foot along the raw edge of your fabric and then put your foot down then check to make sure that the needle is going over right to left left to right 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 to left as you sew so before you do any stitching get the hand wheel just make sure it's going through the end and over the prong yeah I'm happy with that so I'm not going to get no broken needle and then start sewing remember that this is what you need to concentrate on. That will help you keep a straight line as you sew and cover that raw edge. So I'm just taking my time as I go along, just making sure I cover the raw edge. So there we have a beautiful finish to a raw edge using an overlock foot. The overlock foot can be used for a decorative finish or you can use it to cover a raw edge. It's a great little foot to have in your sewing box. If you're new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe by clicking on the subscribe button. Do check out my other video tutorials by clicking on the links below. If you have any comments or queries, please put them in the comment box. We at Fashion Sewing Blog TV would love to hear your views and I will see you next time.